Warning, the following may contain sexual imagery, violence, and strong language. This may create a not safe for work environment. Viewer discretion is advised. Previously, at the Mountains of Badness, Hudo Ese, high school student, found out he's now a devil, apparently. And now, the continuation. Welcome at the Mountains of Badness, where I, Nightmare Alpha, present to you the Eldritch Abominations of Literature. Today, we continue with the second chapter of High School DxD, and I hope we don't need so much time as with the last one. So, now with further ado, we start. Life 2 I Start as a Devil Part 1 Ooh! It's midnight, and I'm paddling my bicycle at full throttle. The reason is simple. I'm handing out the lefflets. They have an easy-to-use magic cycle on them. Yeah, we already know this. The humans, with strong greed, take these in their hands and wish for what they want when we, the devils, will be summoned before them. Uh, I thought we had already taken care of this, but okay. When I look at the portable machine in my hand, what? The monitor is displaying the map of the town I'm currently in, and there are red lights flashing on it. Oh, you mean a, a cell phone, a GPS thing? The fuck? I'm heading to those areas, paddling my bicycle. When I arrive at the flashing point, which is the house belonging to someone, of course it should belong to someone, I put the lefflet inside their mailbox. When I move towards other flashing points nearby, I keep on repeating this procedure. Over and over again. Fuck! It can't be helped! This can't be helped! After all, I'm a devil. I'm pedaling my bicycle while screaming out loud. That's not a good idea. I think back to the day I found out I was a devil. The day I found out I was a sacred gear processor, then I found out that Yuma-chan is a fallen angel, and then I found out that Ria-senpai is a devil. Okay. By the way, my devil wings disappeared immediately after that. Well, it's nice and convenient that they disappeared, I mean, having wings is nice, but also cumbersome, so... Okay. After all, there is something that will become a hindrance to my daily life. Apparently, the wings can be used to fly if I get used to them. The feeling of having wings is really gross. Uh, I disagree. It was a bit of a shocking experience to have wings grow out from my back. Well, if something grows out of your back, it's always kind of a shocking experience, you know? If you work under me, your new life might become very bright, you know? Ria Senpai says this to me with a wink while I'm looking down after l learning I'm a devil. Apparently, in exchange for being re reincarnated as a devil by Ria Senpai, I have to live on as her servant. I think you could do worse. It seems like that is how it is. Apparently. Those who get reincarnated as a devil from being human have to become the servant of the devil who, incar who reincarnated them. More like, the, this is the rule of the devils. Uh, apparently, yes. What? I'm her servant? It might not be that bad to become the servant of a beauty, but still, I can't agree with it. Well, I can agree certainly with it. But you know, there are ranks among devils. It's something called peerage. I also have one. The place of your birth and your family background plays a big role in it. But there are devil, also devils who have risen up. Everyone starts off 
as a novice first. Could you please stop talking like this is like this is a recruitment commercial? But are you serious? I still can't believe it. I also can't believe it. Senpai starts whispering into my ears while I'm complaining. Her crimson hair smells so nice. Oh god, here we go. It feels like my brain will paralyze. What? There is a bee missing. Oh, this is also demonic power? By the way, you might be able to start a life where you can become popular with the girls you know. <gasps> Those words start going around my mind. How? Words came out of my mouth before I tried to think about it. My perverted guts. It's quite remarkable if it's this bad. I don't think it's remarkable if it's this bad, but okay. Wait. This may be the work of the demonic power Senpai cast on upon me. Even I think I have a high tension that I usually do. What? Even I have a high tension that I usually do? What? What's that for a sentence? Majority of the pure devils were killed in the war that took place a long time ago. Because of that, devils started to desperately gather servants. Well, devils don't have the strength or the influence they originally had when they leaded their armies. Even so, we need to keep on increasing the numbers of the devils, just like humans. The devils split in genders of male and female and are able to give birth. But even with normal birth, it will take a lot of time to get back to the same population as before. After all, devils have a low, have a very low birth rate. Then we won't be able to stand up against the fallen angels. So we find humans who seem to have potential and make them into devils as our servants. That is. So I'm a servant after all? Oh, don't make a face like that. Now. I will get to the point. Since this only increases the number of servants, it doesn't increase the number of powerful devils. So the devils decided to give chances for power to reincarnated devils. Those who were reincarnated from humans, they decide to give P-Rage to reincarnated devils as well, as long as they are powerful. Because of that, there are many devils in human society. There are also a number of devils like myself, who came to human society as well. Issei, even though you haven't realized it, I'm sure you have passed through some devils in this town. So were devils were always nearby then? Yes, through they are humans who can distinguish which one are devils and those who can't. A person with a strong greed or a person who wants to get help from devils usually can distinguish us strongly. We are usually summoned by the others, who can distinguish between them through the leaflet with magic cycle that we give out. This is pretty repetitive right now. There are people like you, I say, who can distinguish devils, but don't believe in our existence. But majority of them usually believe it if they see our demonic powers. What? So the reason I summoned Senpai was because I had a strong greed? Yep, bro. Looks like there is a change in the devil's society as well. It must be a difficult thing, but that doesn't matter now. The important thing is that there is also a chance for me as well. When that means I also get a peerage with how I do things? Yes, it's not impossible. Of course, it would take a long time and effort to achieve though. Ooh! I shout inside the club room. Are you serious? Me? I'm able to make my own harem? Oh god. Uh, I can have sex with them as well, right? Yes, I think it's fine if it's with your servants. A thunder strikes my body. Impossible! Yeah, impossible indoors. Something like that is actually possible? In the real world, and also as a human, it's really hard to build your own harem. Yeah, it is. Practically impossible. There's, there's no way 
you can gather herds of girls if you are just an ordinary human. Herds of girls sound so bad. That's because the situation I'm currently in is bad. I don't even have a single girlfriend. Well, getting a single girlfriend isn't that hard. Well, I did, but I was killed by my ex-girlfriend. Oh, I hope I have never to say the sentence again. It's different now. Now I can. Ooh, being a devil rocks. Hell yeah, I can't calm myself anymore. I have probably throw away my porn magazines that I'm secretly hiding. I stop what I was about to say and then started thinking about the decision I'm about to make. No, not the porn magazine. No, that. Not that. I can't throw them away. That's my treasure. I could still use them until my mom finds out about it. And there is a different issue. Yeah, it's... It's a different is issue. Phew, this boy really is funny. Rhea Senpai is laughing as she finds me really amusing. Harara, it's just like Ucho said. He does make me feel like I have a very idiot brother now. Oh man, it's hard to be in his head, believe me. Even Himeja Senpai is laughing while saying Ufufu. <laughs> She's a kind of saying bad things about me. Anyway, you say, you are all right with being my servant, right? If you have potential, then you will eventually stand out. And then you might be also receive a peerage. Yes, Rhea Senpai. Wrong. You have to call me Bucho. Bucho? Can't I say Onesama to you? I got carried away and ask her. I always wanted an Onesama. It's not even a Yuri situation, but all of the girls have decided to curl the old, older beauty an Onesama. Really? I, I didn't have decided that, and I'm 28. Rhea Senpai thought about it seriously for a while, and then shook her head. Hmm, that also sounds wonderful. But since I operate mainly in the school, being called Bucho has a better ring to it. This is a cult research club, after all. And everyone here also calls me that. Okay, when, Bucho? Teach me how to be a devil. Oh no. At my words, Bucho puts on a devilish smile. It seems she's truly happy. Foo foo. Good reply, good boy, you say. Okay, I will change you into a man. Okay. Bucho starts to touch my chin with her fingers. Onesama. It's my Onesama. No, it's not yours. I will awaken as a devil while serving under her from now on. No, I will rise up. This should be fine. After all, I can't revert back being a human anymore, right? Then I will just have to walk straight ahead. I already accepted the situation I'm in. I'm not. I might sound stupid. Oh, it might sound stupid, sorry. But I fine but it's fine, I guess. I already ha I already convinced myself. It's more like I'm a, my perverted guts are functioning on the max. It's also because my tension is too high. I'm relieved that I'm a guy who works for this ambition towards sex. I uh, should pat you on the back for that, I guess. Rather than thinking about uh, the new world I stepped my foot in, I will just enjoy my current life. I'm going to become a harem king. No, you don't. If I think back calmly about that day, I may have been tricked into the situation by Bucho's demonic power. Well, that's okay, I guess. We are talking about a harem here. Being able to create a harem is amazing. And if you say so. With this, I became a member of the Occult Research Club. Few days have passed since I became a devil. I'm just paddling my bicycle like crazy in the middle of the night. Since that day, I've become Rias Bucho's servant and I have been working a lot. First, we gather at the old school building at night. This is because we devils 
can use our power more sufficiently at night. The unknown phenomenon that happened to me is the power of a devil. Since I'm a devil, you mentioned that, my power increases during night times. You already said this. It's such a wonderful thing. No, it's not. But the reason why I feel weak in the morning is also due to me being a devil. I already assumed that. Devils hate light. It seems the stronger the power of light is, the more lethal it becomes to our bodies. Lights are poisonous. That's what I was told by Bucho. It seems like the fallen angels and the angels used light as their weapon. It's natural. It's the natural enemies of devils. I was told to run away if I ever encounter them. But once you get used to it, it seems like you will be okay under the sun. The reason why I'm weak in the morning is because I was resurrected as a devil recently, and my body can't stand the morning light. It seems like I will get used to it after a while. You already said this. The reason why I was left alone when I was resurrected as a devil was because she wanted me to realize the changes of, in my body myself, like a good parent. Assuming that children have puberty, they have to experience for you for yourself. So fun. She was planning to tell me the truth and was waiting for me in, for the right time. That was the day when I was attacked by the guy wearing the suit. So I certainly feel like it was destiny. Anyway, I'm working hard as Rhea's Grammarie's servant devil. Since I just became a devil, I was told to study about the devil's society and how it works. I was ordered to give out these leaflets at night so I can get used to it. For my parents will get worried if I was gone every night, but Bucho said this to me with a smile. That day, I did all the necessary things when I met your parents, so it's fine. Certainly, my parents did get, didn't get mad when I come home late after finishing my work. They just say, welcome home. Hmm, Bucho's demonic power is amazing. No, it's just very man manipulative. Speaking about amazing, oh, he has to talk about this. I was really amazed how much authority Bucho seems to have in the academy. The academy we go to is Bucho's territory. That's why she is like the controller of the academy behind the scene. It seems like the person of in the highest position in our academies have ties to the devils and therefore can't oppose the people of the house grammarie. In other words, the academy is basically Bucho's personal belonging. That's also the reason why we are able to enter the school at night. Oh, I thought she had just a key or manipulated somebody. And now, back to my current work. Every day, I go around on my bicycle, posting the leaflets with, which can summon Rhea's Grammarie's group inside the mailboxes by using a mysterious device. Wait, you can summon them inside the mailbox? Uh, that sounds dangerous. Or somebody translated it wrong. It seems like the device I'm holding onto is a secret machine developed by technology of the devils. Oh, Apple is now the devil. Okay, I can deal with that. It has the shape of one of these current portable game devices. Okay. There is a screen and it has buttons. It's a touch pen type device, so it comes with a touch pen. Is it apparently that the Nintendo DS wasn't out there so long at this time period? And I'm using the device the way I was told to. I hope you do. The monitor displays the map of the town I live in. Who chose territory? That seemingly has no name at all. Each devil is given a certain territory in the human world, and they can only do their job within the territory. God damn it, this exposition dump is very heavy. Our job in the world, in other words, we get summoned, then we then make contract. And when we grant their wish, as a, as a prize, we receive an award fitting for a particular wish they make. It can be money, an object, and at times even their life. Well, it seems like they aren't any contractors who go 
far, who will go far to use their life to make a wish. Even, even if there was a person like that, it usually gets cancelled since a price does match up with their wish. According to Bucho, people's value are, aren't equal. Yup, it's harsh. Yeah, because we're not evil. Because we're not equal, but we are evil, or something like that. And the light flashes on the monitor, shows the house where people with a lot of greed live. Oh, I need some of this device, then I can bullcrap them. So I go to these areas to hand out the leaflets, which come with a magic cycle. Can we just go on this as move? I, I want to move on. As long as there are lights flashing on the monitor, my work isn't finished. Because I turned into a devil, other people and even the police don't pay attention to me. Oh, they should. Since I'm already active as a devil, humans don't realize my presence when I'm working. I have been pedaling my bicycle every day, but the light displayed on the monitor and on the monitor never disappears. That's how much humans are being with strong greed. That, that's how much humans are being with strong... What the fuck is that for a sentence? Once you make a wish, it apparently becomes an addition to keep on wishing for other ones. Uh, what? An addiction to keep on wishing for other ones. Okay, sorry, that was my bad. Making a contract is basically limited to occur at night. That's because devils are only allowed to work at night. The daytime time is, the t is a time for the angels and God. That's, that is the part that I still don't understand. Well, that I don't understand it either, but okay. The leaflets can only be used once, so once they used it, then I will have to hand, them, hand it out again. Okay, seems normal. In other words, my work will last forever. Well, that's good for the economy, I guess. Well, thanks to that, Rias, Bucho and the others can continue to be active, and we never run out of jobs. So we are certainly increasing our point at, at, as being a devil. It seems like we get acknowledged by the king of the devils if we keep on making contracts and granting the wish of, human, of a human. Okay. I see. So if I continue working like this, then I will be able to receive a peerage from the king. So it's better to take on bigger jobs. I want it. I also want to make a contract. Oh, I want to be surrounded by girls soon, as soon as I can. But right now, I have to be patient and keep on doing the simple tasks. But how long do I have? To continue doing this. End of part one. Oh god, this exposition dumps get heavier every time. I, I think we sh should take a break here. It was a pretty long chapter, and I want these videos to be a little bit shorter, you know. People have started to complain about it. So, I see you next week then, hopefully. Oh, you're still here? That means one of three things. One, you liked what you heard. If that's the case, I recommend that you show that by using the small thumbs up button below. Two, you wanted to see how deep the rabbit hole goes and stayed till the end. In that case, you might want to see how it continues by pressing that subscribe button. Or three, you fall asleep while listening. I wish you sweet dreams if that's the case, and hope you come back for more sleep-worthy content. If you want to know something or have issues with what I'm doing, you might want to leave a comment down below. Also, don't forget to call me an asshole in the comments. And now for something else. Recommendations. As always, you should check out Blasperus on DaviDard. He makes great art for great prices, including the art of a show. Link in the description. Also, make sure to check out my latest anime reaction video on the Asterix War episode 18. I heard it featured cyborgs. So, see you next Thursday with more... badness. <laughs>